to YouTube subscribers and anybody else watching this probably on Facebook. <clears throat> I get up a little bit closer to hear me. Um, this is the 23rd day in Thailand after SRS surgery, and um, I alluded to took a problem I had and uh, involving catheter. Um, <clears throat> um, well. Bottom line is I'm, I'm not staying here any longer. I'll be heading back to the States tonight on flight to uh, heading out to Bangkok to five and a half hours to Korea. <clears throat> I'll be there for about 11 hours on a layover. And then um, another 11 hours to a flight to Seattle. So uh, after everything's said and done, I'll be arriving around noon on uh, the uh, Thursday, which is uh, I guess the 29th. Uh, so um, I still have took a problem. I have to uh, see a local doctor when I once I get back home uh, to try to resolve my <coughs> um, incontinence problem with the uh, uh, urethra and all that good stuff. Which I don't. I've already uh, talked about that before, but. Staying here probably is, it has nothing to do with the surgery. It's more about inflammation and swelling to prevent, uh, you know, basically from doing what you need to do uh, to very necessary function that every human has to deal with. I didn't think it was going to be a problem. Obviously, I'm one of the lucky ones that seem to have an issue with it. So, um, and I went through some emotional distraught about that yesterday. I didn't know if I was going to stay or wait until it was healed in Thailand or whatever extent of my stay at the hotel and the visa in this country but doctor felt it was good just to go ahead and uh, uh, go back home with the letter and uh, be referred to a, a proper urologist and someone who can deal with it <clears throat> and um, well of course I, I know we have more than capable doctors in the Seattle Tacoma area so I'm not too worried about that so uh, I had several friends on Facebook, Facebook of course, to stay, stay, get your problem taken care of, but, um, you know, it's, it is, um, it isn't anything that's directly caused by the surgery, just something happened with inflammation due to the surgery. It's just going to take a little bit longer for me to heal than other people. So, anyway, I'm going to be heading back, and I will be back in, uh, in town Thursday. I will, uh, probably have to take it easy under the circumstances but I still plan to uh, go out Thursday night and show up at my regular place that I mentioned I would be going to to see as quite a number of folks that I know and, and uh, um, just take it easy over the weekend uh, the main thing is I got to learn to relax and uh, just chill out probably my own home environment back at my house and It'll be good to get back to the States. It's, uh, you know, being here after a month, it's, it's starting to wear my nerves a little bit, food-wise, the culture. You know, I don't, I, I don't have anything wrong with the culture here or anything like that, but um, it's just the disconnecting yourself from your what you're used to for such a period of time, it does tend to grind on you a little bit. So I'm looking forward to just getting back. I need to chill out, get back to my own familiar surroundings, and then... Uh, deal with my issues next week. Uh, I'm, I'm doing this basically next time I actually go to the doctor and we can have this thing removed and and everything will be fine. If not, I'll try one more week and sooner or later the problem will go away and uh, I'm just glad this is over with. The, the matter of fact, what's interesting is the every other aspect of this kind of surgery was I uh, was picture perfect. Um, matter of fact, we you know we had a number of people, 15 other people here had the similar surgeries, and I'm one of the ones that healed up one of the one of the best ones, and they didn't have to have like corrective surgery afterwards to uh, deal with any issue that came out. So I'm happy about that. It's just uh, just not very happy about that one thing, and uh, rightly so. It seems like I'm the only ones having that problem. So anyway, I don't want to keep belaboring that point on YouTube or, you know, it's just, it did create a great deal of emotional problems with me. Um, I'm flying back. I have to probably take a Xanax or something to uh, uh, keep myself uh, calm because uh, 
you know, I'm on shaky ground right now, emotionally. Um, I can name myself, maintain myself all right on videos or whatever, but uh, behind the scenes, I definitely have, uh, I have my moments, so, <clears throat> but, um, Anyway, um, I, I promised if something was going to do, if something came up, I'd post this video, but uh, I'm going to shut it down right now, and then uh, next time you hear from me, I'll be back home, or I might even post a video if, if I have internet access in Korea, because we've got 11 hours to burn, and just sitting around or whatever, it's just not going to be, you know, I'm just going to have to occupy my mind, so I might as well just post the video then, so. Anyway, everyone take care, and we look forward to all the folks that live up in my area. Glad to see everybody again after a month, and uh, get past all this. So uh, we'll be talking to you later. Take it easy. Bye.